माय ओल्डेस्ट सन वुड लाइक टू बी अ कुक व्हेन ही ग्रोज अप आई नो निकली ऑल माय लाइफ आई हैव बीन हंग्री एंड फोर्ड टू फीड माय चिल्ड्रन माय नेम इज शांति एंड आई एम थर्टी इयर्स ओल्ड माय मदर वाज अ क्लीनिंग लेडी व्हेन आई वाज नाइन माय फादर फेल इल and they had to return to their native village the lady she worked for offered to keep me to study but i only did housework when she fed me very little when i was 13 my parents came to take me to the village they married me the same day to a 20 year old man he wanted kids but i was so skinny and i did not think i had the room for a baby when i was 18 i had three sons my husband left and my parents could not take care of us so i found work at the factory the manager of the factory made advances on me from day one since i refused he kidnapped me from my house and kept me in a locked room i resisted for four months meanwhile my parents thought i was gone they sent my children back to their father who barely fed them Hearing this the manager of the factory promised to take care of them if I married him I accepted he released me we got my three sons back and I had a fourth with him then he left my parents refused to help me i was on the streets with my four children unable to feed them i had no other choice but to apply for a placement They were placed at Tara and I visit them every month. They are all going to school now. They do sports and artistic activities. We regularly go to the judge to report on this situation. He ended up deciding a long-term placement. I'm 30 years old and I can no longer find a job. I have no more strength and my stomach is hollow every day. So with my very last savings, I buy four chocolate bars. I give one to each of my sons telling them to save it for their next birthday in case I can't come enjoy my little ones